hi hello welcome to masquery channel in this video i am going to explain a class sa1 question paper actually uh, sa1 exams for some other districts it is already conducted from november 1st but for a few districts it is postponed sa1 exams so uh, this is the question paper from common district okay see just to i can understand the model of the question paper and how the questions are giving just you can observe and you can prepare for that okay uh, here in this mass question paper first section first section they will give seven questions okay one to seven questions they will give each two marks so here seven questions we need to write answer all the following questions each question carries two marks okay <clears throat> first question find four rational numbers between minus 2 by 3 and 2 by 3 so <clears throat> second question if a is equal to 2 b is equal to minus 3 then find the value of a plus b into a plus b plus 1 okay next third question <clears throat> this is the general question given Raju says that every square is rhombus. Do you? Do you agree with him or not? Justify your answer. Okay. Now, fourth question. Write the properties involved in the following. Okay. See, first one, which property? And second one, which property? We need to write the name of the property. Just we have properties, you know, closure property, commutative property distributive property associative property these all properties we have no so these properties which property is involved in this we should write the name of the property okay next fifth question the marked price of a gift item is 100 and sold rupees 300 find the discount discount we need to find out in the fifth question now sixth question find the perimeter of the rectangular park which is uh, 17 <laughs> 2 by 3 meters long and 10 1 by 2 meters broad here broad means what uh, breadth okay so mixed fraction is given length and breadth we should find out the perimeter okay now seventh question represent 19 by 8 on the number line so how to represent a rational numbers on the number line this is the concept based uh, concept so section 2 see section 2 8th question if 2 power x is equal to 32 then find the value of 2 power x plus 2 second bit 2 power x minus 2 okay we should find out that values next ninth question if 2x plus 3 by 3x minus 2 is equal to 3 by 2 then find the value of x 10th one the following numbers are not perfect squares give reasons okay here <coughs> section 1 yeah. c1s all are easy questions only next to section section 2 also they given e easy only basics questions only they have given so here we should answer all the questions each question carries four marks okay now see tenth question the following numbers are not perfect squares give reasons find the amount next question 11th one 10000 at 10% 10 per annum for two years compounded annually 12th one express the following numbers in the standard form 13th one write the p by q form of 0 0.54 bar okay this for this we have process so by through the process we can find p by q form of the given number okay next third section third section we should each question has internal choice each question carries eight marks so you want to write a means you can write a if you want to write b means you can write b okay so 14th 15th 16th 17th each question having internal marks a and b <coughs> here we should write a or b any one question we should write these are the easy questions only they given so once uh, look at the questions a 
14th, 15th, 16th. I am not reading. Just to you can uh, read and you can do yourself. C. C. 16th B1. Is subtraction associated in rational numbers? Explain with an example. Easy question. Actually, this, this is from chapter 1. Right? So, like that. Uh, so, 17th one. Construction is given. And uh, internal choice is. Uh, that histogram graph you can plot a given data okay these all easy questions only so uh, eighth class students once look at the question paper model and uh, based on the same model uh, you can concentrate on the questions okay i hope everyone understand thank you